So we got a game that we play on our oh, show. Oh, shit. It's called Quick Time with Slime. It's a shot uh, game. I'm draining um, Charles. I need y'all to relax. Shot game. Come on. Ah! All right, so we're going to play. Uh, like, ah! That side of the room, y'all. Y'all was distracting me. Um, you're gonna, so it's, it's you pick one or the other. If you pick two, you take a shot. If you pick none, then you take a shot. And we take a shot with you. Yeah. Okay. Just not me today. I'm just fucked up today. But I don't have a problem. Okay, you ready? Don't cheat. Wait, who's drinking for No, no, no. Don't cheat. Come on, Sonny. Sonny, come on. Sonny, come on, Sonny. I still want to come. I still want to come. It's all good. Sonny, we need you over here. Sonny, we need you over here. Sonny's going to take my shot. Sonny, come over here. Come on, Sonny. Get over here. Sonny, get your ass up. Put your Rolex back on. You take it off on the weekends? What are you doing? Oh, shit. Ha, Put the rolly on, Nick. Come on, come on. Let's go. All right. Off top, I don't. Uh, no, sit by door, man. What, 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 I don't mind. You, you gonna stand there, guess, sit right there. But um, what kind of shots you guys want? What you got? Man, I'm just drinking the shock. What you got? No, no, we, we got, we got, we got Douce. We got Ciroc. What is that? Yo, we got the tequila. You, you, you got the tequila for you? This is Mama Juana. You got some Mama Juana? What is it? It's Mama Juana. I don't <laughs> recommend it. Don't do I it? I don't. I don't. No, he, he's, what does it taste like? I think, I think you'll like it. <laughs> he ass. said I think you'll like it. I think you'll like it. <laughs> it tastes like ass and pennies. Okay. <laughs> I like pennies. <laughs> you like pennies? <laughs> <laughs> I eat pennies. I don't eat ass. That's eat ass. If you and eat I, pennies. I can tell you if I'm a fuck with That's what Eddie, Eddie asked you to say. That's what, uh, that's what, that's what ass sound like. tastes like. Pennies. It could be a we shot. Or it could ass. be a religious movement. Whatever you yeah, want to do. Yeah, whatever. All right. So you ready? I'm ready. Yeah, ready. Uh, yeah you, you don't got to take it yet. Okay. Oh, no, 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 you ain't got to go that far. You ain't got to go that far. No, I'm not going to shoot. Right, you, right. you keep that bottle. I got another yeah, one yeah, over yeah, here. Oh! Like I'm Chachi. just going to sip it. You got right. to get a shot soon, huh? Yeah, yeah come well, on. If get... I need to, I'll drink yeah, yeah, some. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get some of the rock. You guys are a team right now. All right, all right. I'm going to start it off. I'm going to start it with you, and then I'm going to bounce back and forth. Oh, we don't both answer just one at a time? One at a time. Yeah, one at a time for now, just okay. to make it. Um, but, but you got to drink either way. Yeah. <laughs> no. Okay. No, 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 no. Too short or E40? You talking to him or me? You. Too short. All right, I'm going to ask you there too. Too short or E40? Wow. Short dog. And you said? Too short. You said short dog. I'm too. from Oakland. Okay. All right. Yeah. Is there a reason why? I'm from Oakland. No, on the real, on the real there's a reason why because too short is really my biggest inspiration to think that I could become an MC. Only because growing up in Oakland, uh. I thought that you had to be from New York or LA to make a record. Uh. But to, you know, when I was a kid or a teenager, and to see a motherfucker that's on the same bus with you yeah. and he got a record out, that's like, oh, I can do it. Well, you rode the bus for two shows? I've been on the bus. Okay. I've seen him on the bus before. The Charlie? Huh? The Charlie? No, not the Charlie. Uh, <laughs> Actually, no, I take that back. I was on a bus and he was at the bus stop. He was outside. I rode okay. by and he had the, the old too short hat. I was mm. like, oh shit, that's too short. Okay. On, but you know, just being able to right. see and touch somebody that was doing it made me feel like I could I could do it. So, so I'm you always. You heard him say, bitch, it changed your life. Exactly. Yeah. I'm always this makes good, too noise short. Too short. Yeah. Yeah. You short, my nigga. Too short. Souls of Mischief or De La Soul? De La. I got mm. to do De La. Wow. And I got Bloods. a reason for that. I've Bloods. always said that De La Soul, you know, you know, everybody talk about they got many styles. De La has many styles. Mm. From song to song, cadence to concept that right. goes specifically with the track. I think De La does that better and more than any hip hop group in history. I agree. Um, I agree. They like got their masters back. Is, is that something yep. you guys are interested in? Um, I'm happy for them and it's, 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 it was time. Is you know, because really, you know, try to do like, um, well, you know, um, I don't even know if I should say this loud, but I'll say it loud. But only reason being for some artists because after I think it's 33 or 34 years, mm -hmm. no matter what, your masters revert back to you anyway. Mm -hmm. And the only reason why I say not to say it loud because mm -hmm. labels also know that. So mm -hmm. if they're still making they money off your masters, when it gets close to that time, right. they start trying to do shit to hold you up. Right. But right. I'm not sure how many years passed. Mm -hmm. You know, but but from what I understand, um, if it's Warner or Tommy Boy, they also still kind of. 
make money yeah. from it. Yeah. But you know, I think all artists, especially from the era, we should all get our masters back. And, um, and it's, it's what, one more thing before we move on. Sure. Um, you know, on Dela, you know, on Pop. Right. You know, on original Pop, and then Pop has this record dissing Dela mm. later on in life. Mm. Where was you at? And how did you how did you comprehend that? I thought it was a misunderstanding. And I thought that. Oh, you knew what it was about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, they in the video. What's the. Um, oh, that was something specific oh. that it was about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Remember the video where, they, where De La Soul. They, they is, perpetrated is, dogs. They, yeah, they and, and they got their own in the hot tub, and then they oh, just fake, I, oh. and all that shit. And then, Pop was like, he thought they was taking shots at him. Because all around the world? Around. He's in the hot tub. Nah, from. Oh. from uh, uh, you know the song. Get Around? Is not from Get Around. But I'm saying, not taking shots is at y'all, and I get around. Tupac took it as De La was taking shots at him wow. when they was like perpetrating with the with the, right, the no, hot yeah, tub yeah. and then they take the shit away mm-hmm. or whatever. It, mm-hmm. He felt like it looked too much like him mm-hmm. in that video. So like I said, Pac is gonna snap back right. right away. It was surprising to me because we were cool with De La and I'm sure De La thought the same thing. Right, so it caught um, them off guard if anything. Right, and I don't think that De La did that specifically to take a shot at Pac. They were just taking a shot at, at the industry. At the industry. Right. Because that's what niggas do, you know. It's right. in every R and B video. Right. Motherfucking yeah. hot tub with the girls. Right, right. Da, 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 da. So that's that's what that was about. So I, I when I heard it, I was like, ah. you know. But I I'm not sure. Look tell me what Google says. <laughs> <laughs> I think that they they kind of made peace with that before he passed. Mm, okay. Biggie or big punt? Biggie. Lyrically or as a person? Whatever you want. Uh, I'm gonna go with Big. I'm go with Big. Cause I know him. Okay. Tupac or DMX? Tupac. Machiavelli. Easy. Okay. L.A. or Miami? <laughs> wow. <laughs> He's from LA, so he's gonna say West LA's in the building. <laughs> um, I don't know enough about Miami, so I'm gonna say LA. Okay, obviously LA, right? Yeah, I've only but been here. But the motherfucking purple tape was written here, so I'm loving Miami. <laughs> Shout out to y'all niggas. Man. <laughs> so Yuck Mouth or Mr. Fab? Mm. <laughs> Yuck Mouth, nigga. It's crazy because that's a good one. Mr. Fab is from from my neighborhood, uh. but lyrically. I always say that Yuck Mouth doesn't even get appreciated yeah, no, he, half he, as much as he should. Yeah. He's a beast. Yeah. So, Yuck Mouth. Okay. If we're talking hip hop. Yuck Mouth. Yuck Mouth. All day. Okay, Scarface or Ice Cube? Take a shot. Cube. Cube. Cube? Dumb yeah, y'all said that too easy. No, that's my, you know, Face is my guy. <laughs> and we love Face. Oh, yeah, Face is my guy. Motherfucking yeah. Death Certificate. Yeah, I'm riding with he's, that. He's the guy, but, you know, Cube, come on. All right. Okay. Radio or podcast? podcast? In my older age, podcast. Okay. I don't even listen to the radio no more. All right. Me neither. 80s or 90s hip hop? 90s. 80s. Mm. 90s. 80s. 80s? Yeah. Why? Because that's what shaped me. Mm. Right? You know, I, we came out in 90, but I, I took everything, you know, I, we took the... the EPMD. You fell in love with it. Yeah, Rakim, Karis One, the fucking. It molded you. The the Crash Crew, the the Fearless Four. Mm. You know, that's that's my shit. Okay. Fresh Gordon from Tommy Boy. Mm. (laughs) NWA or Wu Tang? NWA. Wu Tang, I got to represent for mine. You gotta start taking shots when y'all disagree. <laughs> oh, that's what you want? I take a sip. <laughs> yeah, take a shot. Come on, go, go, go. Hey. Hey. So I you see said, what this shot is. You said NWA like that. You don't like that. You said NWA like that, and you said Wu Tang like did, that. I swear. Okay, I, I just wanted to see your explanation. NWA. Well, I, well, you took a shot. We actually, this underground okay. comes from the NWA family. Right. If it wasn't for NWA, yep. Because right. our our Asian Gregory. He used to he used to road manage uh, for Ruthless Records. In wow, WA. that's crazy. And wow. he, he used the money that he made working with Ruthless to start his label, which signed Digital Underground. Wow. So we came up under and around NWA. 
but that's you know that's just part of it. The other reason is, <clears throat> you know, I'm from Oakland, and if you know our culture, you know, we ride around with 415s in the trunk. Mm -hmm. We we, we bang it. So when Wu Tang came out, I didn't hear it because it wasn't we wasn't slapping it in right, our cars right, like right, that because right. it was it was right. it didn't it didn't bump. Like I used to like uh, what's it? They used the underdog shit. Wu Tang Clan. Yeah, that was my shit. Okay. Right. I used to play that in my in my Mustang. Right. Okay. And I had you know I had like I said I had four fifteens. That shit used to pound. But other than that, it wasn't what I was riding around and the ladies wasn't paying attention to that. Mm. That's what I was on. Mm. He was rocking too short. Mm. WA. Well, if it ain't got no... If it, the bass, the bass. Wu-Tang didn't have enough bass lines for me. Right. You okay. feel me? It right. had nothing to do with, with them personally. It's right. just that it's... And it was, you know, it was mixed sonically. NWA would sound better in my car than Wu-Tang. Wu-Tang was more of a headphones on the, on the train type mm. shit. I got it. I, well, it took me a while to get it. Mm. Like, I love Wu-Tang. Mm. But I didn't get it when they first came out. Right. So now you you said Wu Tang. I being said, from I LA. said it quickly. Oh, he's a Wu Tang yeah, yeah, so guy. I, I, need to, I, need to, I need to know the explanation. Yo, man, my perspective on the matter at hand is that the Wu Tang is the greatest shit to ever happen to hip hop. I said it, quote me, in any shape, form, and fashion. I love the God so much. I just came from the rest. That's why my voice is parched. I was over there wilding at the Ray Ghost and Jizz Three Chambers tour. That's wow. how I get down. I mean, That's if anything, both of those. Niggas right there. Crews and those groups are the best thing that ever happened. Yeah, no, they're 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 the they're, ultimate they person are, right there. The the ultimate ultimate person. wouldn't exist without from the NWA. tree from the NWA yeah. in the tree that yeah, they spun right. and, and Wu Tang. What, I'm, the what tree I'm saying they is spun. they're both equally great. Right. But if you ask me one or the other off the rip, I'm going to immediately say NWA. Right. I'm going to say NWA over a lot of groups. Right, absolutely. You know, you if know. you say, you might say Digital Underground or NWA, I'm going to go like, oh, hey, yo, I don't my know. two favorite albums is Death Certificate and Only Built for Cuban Links. Mm -hmm. Death Certificate with Ice Cube? Yeah. yeah. That's, that's one of the best albums my two in, in, albums. in hip hop and in music, I think. Period. Like, like one of the best albums. Right. Okay, all right. DJ Quick or Dr. Dre? <laughs> <laughs> Pour me a shot. <laughs> I wouldn't go drink. I wouldn't, I wouldn't go drink a shot, but I'll drink a shot. Lord of shot have there. mercy, yeah, yo, that's the hardest. He question. finally got me, man. He finally have, got me. You don't want no mama Juana, man. They don't yeah. have measurements that are capable of answering that question. Yeah. So I respect uh, this is red. red to y'all niggas. I love y'all. Yeah. Quick, Dre. Love so we just you know drinking. Yeah. Let's drink to DJ Quick and Dr. Dre. I love them both. Yo,